Okay, it's opened. Look at scroll. Five to find, three are one. One gives access to the bladed sun. Five to find, three are one. One gives access to the bladed sun. So the bladed sun gives access. The silver orb to banish below, the staff of ages to vanquish the foe. Joining the two, the golden blade, the last to invoke the platinum horn. Yeah, that's what right, you remember. So, <clears throat> so the three are one. That means you got to put. Uh, oh, my light is on. Um, so you got to combine three things on the staff. Right. Right. And if I remember right, it's the or the silver orb, the bladed thorn thing that I just did, and the staff itself. So the three are one. So five are Sorry. found. The bladed sun is the talisman that I have. We don't have the orb, and I'm telling you, I'm going to make a guess that it's on the other side of this ugly fucker. Yeah, but how to open up this ugly fucker? See, there's no bridge behind him. No, there's no bridge. Let's hit him. But remember, you did something, and the bridge rose up out of the lava. Uh, Terak? Because that's about a key to Earth. Nope, that wasn't it. Turning invisible won't help. Illuminating won't help. I feel like I'm missing a spell. We are probably. Well, where have we been blocked from going? We got two places. The door across this lava and the right. uh, the locked door next to the well. And of course, what I beam a, thing. What what there's that room to the right of the gargoyles. What is that? That's this room? That's this room. Okay, we also have this bullshit door on the left. I think that's always there to hate you. Like, maybe it's not. Maybe if we use a poker, we can hold the thing up. There was also the door near the wraith that was too high up. I think that's a I don't think that goes to anything. Secret passage opposite the crusher? It's fair. Let's look. Wasting time. There's still two sconces where the torches were. Huge stone slab. It actually recognizes that there is this huge stone slab. Let me try using the poker on the huge stone slab. Nothing happened. Okay. This is why this game was so fucking impossible. <clears throat> Give me just a sec. What? Oh. Okay, I'm wasting a gold coin to do this. So it's not this, right? Safe state. No. So let's try using it on the sword. It was a one in three chance. One the artifact noticed the bladed sun is now secured in its place. Okay. Yeah? Um. 
blow blow the stupid horn. Oh yeah, yeah, you're right. Gotta find it. That was a while ago. Whoop! Too far. Where the fuck is the horn? Okay, there it is. Sound of the horn echoes loudly, loudly in your ears. Suddenly, you hear the sound of grinding rocks as all the skulls begin to descend. Hot wind erupts from the mouth, creating the illusion that the stone skull is alive. Is the warlock beyond this point? Am I being dumb? I'm pretty yep. sure he is. Yeah, but... yeah, I fucked up. I fucked up. All right, <laughs> that's fair. All right, legit. <laughs> <clears throat> You you want you did want to let him kill us? I mean, I can if you want me to. I mean, we've come this far. All right, all right. You can read this then. The cavern that you have entered is by far the largest your eyes have ever gazed upon. Fuck! From the depths rises the most powerful creature that has ever existed, the behemoth. Your stomach knots up and you shit as you stare at this new horror. The beast is indeed incredible. You wonder for a moment what the fuck you are doing here. How could you defeat such a creature as this? What the fuck am I doing here? Um... Ah... <laughs> uh... Hamina? <laughs> like, we got nothing. There's nothing we can do here. I don't even think we can escape. Cast invisibility and get the fuck out of here. <laughs> nothing happened. There must be something missing. And like your wits. Let's... Actually, let's look around. Well, we're gonna die, so... Your jaw drops as you stare in awe at the silence, uh, odd silence at the sight of the great titan. Acid drips from his jaw and sizzles on the ledge below. Although his back is turned, you know beyond a shadow of a doubt that that's the warlock lord. It seems that his staff is controlling the creature, keeping it at bay. I mean... You're excited. <laughs> we could hammer him. Use hammer. On the warlock. Nothing happened. Let's talk with the warlock. How you doing, buddy? How's your day been going? It doesn't seem to understand what you say. Can we get out of here? Yes! Can we, can we move back in? Oh. I don't, that kind of takes a lot of the terror out of it. A little bit. You just, I mean, you just dilly dally. For fuck's sake. <laughs> Let's try to stab it with a horseshoe. Nothing happened. I wonder what the test tube was for. There we go. <laughs> there well, we are. <laughs> the Warlock Lord feels your presence and knows that you are the seed that must be destroyed. What? Hit Behemoth. Flames shoot forth from his staff and engulf your body. You have failed. It is a sad thing that you have to use another safe state. Let's back up. <laughs> so we'll use the talisman here to get it out of my inventory. Alright, so there's no way around it. We've got two more gold coins, it's fine. <sighs> We've got a locked door. <clears throat> Hit it. Seems 
give you a few consumable items. Hmm. So we've got a locked door and we've got a lava pit that needs a bridge. What if we... no... What's up with this cup? Pewter goblet that glows with a lustrous sign. What that means. So what if we use bottle two? This seems really unlikely. What? It's not letting me drink the the feather fall potion anymore. Yeah, no, that that's not it. All right, hold on. Let's let's take a moment. Let's take a moment. I have a set of bellows. Maybe I could put out the fire with the bellows because that's what they're for, right? Putting out fires. Hold on. Go go through the inventory real quick. Hold sure, on. sure. Let me get down to the bottom first. So we have these spells. Alright, torch. There's bottle scroll. We know what those are. Cop coins. Mm -hmm. That's not it. Now, the broom... The broom is an answer to a question, right? Yeah, the broom is the answer to the Sphinx question. That's all it's for. Okay, so... You go up. Bling, sword, skull, key, map... I'm also thinking what? that maybe the poker and the bellows were also answers to the uh, to the Sphinx riddles. The map, the poker were also answers. Okay. Test tube. Okay, go up again. Try the bellows on the statue. You know what? While we're going around here, let me go ahead and try the bellows on the statue. Although it does have a set of coals, right? It's holding a set of coals. Seems that way. Precious metals holding the basin of smoldering coals. And poker in the yeah, I'm on poke it. Adam, <laughs> nothing happened. All right, all right. Let's go back through the inventory then. Uh, test tube. Uh, what is bottle four and bottle three? Jar is extremely slimy, and bottle three is a silver vial. Save a state and eat them. <laughs> you know, you're not wrong. Glug, you swallow the viscous fluid. It's like drinking tar. Well, so three doesn't do anything. You can't seem to find a keyhole. Oh, shit. On I yourself. just tried to use the key on myself. Yeah, you tried to shove it up your ass and it didn't work. That's where the keyhole is. It's how you unlock people. Why anal's so good? So the viscous lose drink like tar. Okay, so those, those were both tar. I just ate tar. That was tar I was eating. <laughs> okay, they're back. So what else do we got? We got a couple of gold coins, the horn, the scroll, and staff. We're running out of shit. No. Nah. We. Okay, so. We... Can we look at ourselves real quick? Let's look at ourselves. Cause yeah, sure. on, don't we look like a fucking nerd? We've got we've got this ridiculous cape. We've got some fucking <sighs> glasses. No, we are truly a brave knight. We are wearing the cloak, which is incidentally what was protecting us from the extreme heat of the dragon. That's what that was. It's an asbestos cloak, I think was a theory. Okay. Uh, we are wearing glasses. <laughs> so yes, we are a fucking nerd. Uh, okay. We, we aren't wearing the silver gauntlet. That's it. I feel We're like, missing something. Yeah, somebody is yelling the something at us. We've used the gauntlet, right? 
and mm-hmm. we've you and and we've made use of the cape. Yep. We have not made use of the glasses. But how would we know? Oh wait, we have this map, right? Did we get the map before or after the glasses? We got the map at the same time as the glasses. Damn, you're right. Go back to the library. Where we got the map. Oh my god! Glasses. You're right, there was that book in the library, do you remember? We couldn't I read it. Let's go back. <laughs> yeah, it's time it's time to backtrack. Shall we sing the backtrack song? <laughs> Backtrack, backtrack, fucking backtrack. Gotta do this shit again. Shit again. <laughs> backtrack, backtrack, goddamn backtrack. Or and or and or again. Okay, there we go. Open the book. Look at book. Take a look. It's in a book. Wow, with these glasses, you can understand and read what you could not before. Uh huh. Yeah, these are, uh, what's his name, uh, John Smith's glasses? What's the name of that guy in Mormon thing? Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, Hold on, read it, read it, read it. All right. The light grows faint, the path winds, winds round, where life is lost, wis- wisdom is found. Shut up, I don't know what happened. The seed of a dream, for the evil is free, where the sword is hung... He must place the key. Well, fuck, man, we did that. Oh, hey, oh, there's the key. A bridge. There's the key to the to get into the thing. A bridge to from a Miss Burning. A bridge death. to from a <laughs> demon to guard. Motari, Motari rising. Right. That okay. That was as the spell so was re- chanted. The book quickly vanishes. So, we were missing a spell. See, we got there eventually. Hey, don't swim in that. That's I'm, that's lava. I'm- I'm crossing my fingers. I'm crossing my No, this fingers. is it. This is absolutely it. Motari. Motari rises. The statue lowers and a large platform rises out of the lava. You now have a way across. <laughs> See, I'm, I, I kept remembering that. That picture there. Alright, now is the lever puzzle. Wait, stalagmites go go upwards, right? Anyway, surround this room like the cavernous jaws of a huge beast. Oh, fucking fine. Hang on. Hold your horses, you lousy torch. The torch is lit. It's lit. <laughs> okay, well, I got this thing here. Uh, uh, right, middle, right. Use... This use middle and use this. There we go. I wrote well, it down. How did you do that so fast? Oh, you, because you I wrote, wrote it, it down. down. <laughs> oh, I wrote oh, it down. Right. It was in the Sphinx's room. The, c- the cylinder lifts with a shuddering sound. <laughs> You're momentarily dazzled as the darkness is lit. But what we didn't know is this is the demon core, and now we have cancer. <laughs> Silver orb is revealed. You know what? I don't think we go through that locked door in the well. Or if we do, I don't know how. As soon as you remove the orb, the cylinder closes. Actually, let's right. look at the damn thing before we do that. Let's, let's... Aha! It's an orb made of silver! It's glowing surfaces causes your skin to tingle! <laughs> It's With definitely cancer. Giving you cancer. <laughs> yeah, it's <laughs> definitely giving you cancer. Radiation poisoning is even worse than cancer. I don't know, man. There was that cancer giving uh, gun on uh, on Harley Quinn, and they seem to think it was a real bad move. Light cascades through the room as the staff becomes a living entity. We now have everything. We can now defeat the warlock. And shit. 
We can shit all over the warlock. Burned every rug in his fucking house. Yes, we did. And his tapestry. We didn't even need to. It didn't, we didn't gain anything from it. No, it was for inconveniencing us, that dick. <laughs> <laughs> it's incidentally, it's why you're great to DM. <laughs> One, you're really spiteful. Two, boy, are you manipulating, uh, uh, manipulatable because of it. <laughs> This guy, this guy in the street trips you. I'm gonna find his family and kill him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, after you left last night, there was a guy that did me kind of wrong. Doomlad had to watch me try to hunt him down. <laughs> <laughs> kind of wrong, not wrong. You, you, you admit it's kind of. Well, I mean, he probably didn't mean anything, but I'm gonna kill him anyway. It's his ass. It's definitely his ass. <laughs> He mouth he mouth cap off. Oh, of course he did. Okay, we're gonna save state just in case. All right. Use the horn. Uh, suddenly skull opens up into Skeletor's room. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See, yeah, it's a behemoth, and I agree that it's the behemoth, but it's no Tarask. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just use the staff. On the, <sighs> we're gonna use the staff on the behemoth. You, you want to read this? I believe this is the ending. <laughs> you pray as you. Raise the Staff of Ages, that it has the power the Prophets have claimed. Staff pulsates with power and a beam of light explodes from it, striking the behemoth. One might say that it throbs with power, and he unloaded <laughs> its load. You thrust it, verily. Yeah, that behemoth is like, the fuck you, I'm out of here. I got what I wanted. <laughs> Ah, poor says, Fuck! <laughs> As he's dragged into the chasm. It looked really confused. Like, wait, what the fuck? Why are you grabbing me? He, he shot you. <laughs> the creature screams in agony, thrashing back and forth in great pain. In his rage, he grabs the warlock lord. Fuck, he says, and descends into the depths. You can hear the warlock lord's screams fade into the silence, and suddenly it is very quiet. Fuck you! All humans look the same. <laughs> <laughs> a beautiful light seems to fill the cavern. The morning sun! You say to yourself, it is over! <laughs> Although exhausted, you lean on the Staff of Ages and begin your long journey home. Because your dickhead friend wizard won't transport you back. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're, we're going to talk about... So, word of your historic quest has already reached the furthest parts of the land. That happened oh. fast. Your wizard friend fucking told him, but he couldn't transport you back home. No, of course he couldn't. He's not a wiz... Oh. Uh, you are, you are triumphantly graded as you enter the city of... The royal city of Stormhaven. Is that, uh, is that from... Is that, that's the Sword Coast? I don't know. Sorry, I couldn't transport you, lad. I found something called peyote. <laughs> <laughs> you need to give it a try. <laughs> the druid is just spending all his time in the forest, <laughs> stoned out of his mind. Moments later, <laughs> you're ushered into the royal palace where you are greeted by the king. I thought I was the last of the Lida kings. Oh, you need to read this. <laughs> I know what thou hast done, brave one. The world would be dark forever without thee. Give me a fist bump, stud muffin. Hi. <laughs> Are we frozen? Oh, I hope not. Are we fro- Oh, come on! No, fucking Christ. Alright, we're good. 
You are bestowed a kingdom to rule and the king's fairest daughter's hand. Huzzah! Huzzah! It's like this king had a spare kingdom laying around. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm not using this barony over here. You can use that one. As you leaveth the throneth room, you knoweth that although if this quest this is over, others is the wait. <laughs> After all, the bards will need new legs to new legends to sing <laughs> and new, new tales to tell. Shut up! I'm having a hard day. <laughs> <laughs> All the boards are gonna need new legs. <laughs> <laughs> I uh I understand your annoyance, uh ki king, new king, but did you have to cut off all of the pod's legs? <laughs> 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 the first story's end. We never got a second or third shadow gate. No, no not really. And then that's it. It's just stuff. So is it me or are those two guards on either side really tall? Just like ridiculous. Like move them back to where the king and, and princess is. I assume that's the yeah, princess. Yeah, they are freakishly, freakishly tall. And that's uh, Shadowgate. There are no credits. <clears throat> there, there was um, there's no so credits. It just not stops here. Uh, in 2012, they were going to try and do a Kickstarter. No, they did it. Um, I don't know about a sequel, but they remade... Uh, yeah, it's Return Shadow to Gate. Shadowgate. Which, um... <laughs> I have. You have Return to Shadowgate. Well, I have Shadowgate. Oh, oh yeah, the Watamote thing. So, so I have a copy of sort of the retelling of Shadowgate. Okay. So next up, like not tonight, I'm tired. We did this all in one night. That didn't take long. That only <laughs> took like three and a half hours. Um, you and I are going through the remake. <laughs> oh, so th this is a pre. Oh, yeah. This is the prelude, motherfucker! <laughs> oh, that! what a nice surprise! I had no fucking idea! So... <laughs> okay, now that's what you were talking that's about. What oh, that's what I was trying... that's fantastic! Yeah, that's what I've been trying to do. Oh, that kicks ass. And I cannot wait. next time, we're gonna start on episode three. <laughs> <laughs> Ha 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 ha!